All right, so we have a little adventure today with Shepherdstown Rob and Chartsburg Jesse. Chartsburg, okay? Chartsburg, Chartsburg Jesse. And Rob has, has been telling me about these little dowsing rods that he uses for different things. And you can find things with it. In the field and it cross. We take that metal detector right where it crossed, go over it, there'd be a signal. I dug, I've dug a wheat penny out of there. We've dug um, some kind of cap for an old cap. We found a lot of different things just using this. And this is something you made, right? This, this is, one your... is the one I bought. I have okay. one that I made out of a thicker gauge. So we, he's been telling me these stories all the way down. Now I kind I'm very skeptical, although I think there is something to it because I've tried it before with looking for water when I built my house, and every time I went over a certain area, it would cross. Um, so what we did is what he did. Is he just took a bullet and he pitched it out there somewhere, not too far, and I'm going to try using these to find it. <laughs> I was gonna film me doing it. <laughs> uh, okay, so I know you wanna do it? missed me, so I'm back. What? I know they all missed me. I'm yeah, back. I guarantee it. Yeah. All right, so you're saying to hold them. You, hold them you want to hold them so that they can swivel. Yeah, and you 90 want 90 degrees. So, and you think uh, that far apart? Uh, a little farther. A little further. Hold them where your your arms are kind of even with your body. Yeah. Okay. So the story behind dowsing rods is the energy field in the earth and different things it utilizes that in your body um you want to do it with a clear mind from what i've read but holding it like this as he walks you'll notice that they'll turn they used to use this for or they still do to find water sources i've used it and found relics so when he walks and the direction it turns he'll go ahead and turn that direction and walk again and if it crosses you've just crossed over that item and that's when you can go and dig or look but i did throw a civil war bullet out there so we'll see what it does so go ahead and start Somewhere walking slowly okay all right and i don't know where he threw it i know it's out here somewhere now you got to guide me with this stuff it's just kind of like yeah you just want to make sure that they're same height same height together I'm not gonna twist my hands at all and hold them still Civil War bullet, come to a bow. <laughs> Not quite level, okay. Okay, so. I did not do that, it just seemed, oh, the other one's turning too. So they cross there. Can I keep going a little bit further? You can. Usually if you cross and pass something, it'll go behind you. So that I mean, I didn't do that. They moved on their own, which is kind of weird. So now what would I do? So that's where you would take your detector and metal detect in that area where you just stepped over. So this is like a potential site for your mini ball. Yeah, or there's something in, in the ground right there that... So what happens if we keep going? It'll go back behind you. Turn around and walk back, maybe walk in a different path like forward or move over to your, How about your we, can i go straight first just to yeah. see if they want to make sure you kind of hold it tilt it down just, right, a, little just a little bit, bit. okay yeah all right I, well, I was trying to keep them perfectly yeah before. no you're supposed to hold them so it's a tilted bit tilt. yeah okay all right so yeah so there's something for the same area right? there's that's something that's pointing know. that direction it could be something good it could be <laughs> Uh, I was trying to hold it steady, and it just came right around. Yeah, way. so that when they when they go back around you like that, yeah. that means it's behind you. Now, with your bullet probably isn't. No. Okay. Um, when my son uses it, I've had it to where I've asked it questions, and it would actually respond. But when he uses it, it always responds. If it crosses when you ask it a question, that means yes. If it goes back behind you, that means no. Yeah, when they start turning, just keep walking, and then you'll see which direction they, they'll they turn. And that's usually where there's a source of... So they turn that way. So in that direction, somewhere, something is picking up the magnetic it field, been whatever. interesting for us to have marked, because they did the same thing for me. Remember, it took me over to the road, yeah. and you said, man, it's not on the road. But that's where it took me. I was wondering if you like, we were in the same spot. Mm -hmm. Pretty close, I bet. Pretty close. Yeah. Huh. Me. So I'll go this way and then come back and see if it crosses again. <laughs> that's, 
That's wild. Same spot. Yeah. It's picking up on the chig now. <laughs> I don't. I don't remember exactly where it's at. Um, well, I can say for me, it, it didn't. That spot didn't work for the bullet, but. It's kind of weird that the same spot down it's here weird how it, it's, it, it, both took it, us into the driveway. <laughs> it turns automatically. It makes you like, okay, why is this turning? Yeah. So there's where it was turning for you guys. Yeah. Let's go ahead and walk a little further and see. So right here, it crossed. I got some old brick right here grab that metal detector and swing right here and see if there's any kind of signal that you get so that mm -hmm. way we're not crazy so it crosses right here so usually when you cross over it it'll cross like that and it's usually right at the back of your your heels mm -hmm. they have um underground electricity here so i wonder if that's what we're hearing here. There's a lot of iron here. All right, so it didn't work for the bullet, but it did make some weird motion for a scissor bullet uh, when we, um, both Jesse and I kind of at the same spot, like went not, so went back toward that hill back there, so, so not 100%. Not so you're gonna walk over the bullet again. Of course, this is kind of a tainted test, really, because you know where it is. I'll close my eyes. You just gotta tell me if, what? if they're. Well, yeah, you don't have to close your eyes, Rob. You have to think, bullet. <laughs> it failed you. Must be beat some uh, bad juju in that thing, in that bullet. Where is it? You, it's behind you. Oh. <laughs> All right, so either it's not working on bullets today, some bad juju, we're just not really sure, but you did walk right over it again. Oh, okay. so. so let me just. Get that cross where we both, me and Poe both got it. Well, it crossed right when I stepped over it, that direction. Yeah, I don't know, I don't dude. Know. The problem is, you know, you know where it is, so. You know but, where it is, but though, normally dude. it will cross. <laughs> I think it's still going to be uh, controversial. Yeah, that's, that's Either controversial. <laughs> All right, can we go dig in? Let's I want to go there. find a bullet. We, we've got... <laughs> We've got the permission oh, yeah, for the metal sector, I guess. Yep, right today. To oh, yeah. Well, yeah, it was fun, though. Thanks for showing me that. She'll shake the coins from your pocket, take your gold chain and your locket. Mother Earth has no sympathy. She'll take the ring from your hand and bury it in the sand and keep it for eternity. Mother Earth, she's got her secrets.